So I'm standing here in Austin at the Republican Party of Texas headquarters, and I have just filed to become a candidate for lieutenant governor of the state of Texas. Uh, this is a, a job that I did not want, uh, a fight that I did not want, but it is a fight that has been brought to us. Because time and time again, the establishment politicians have told us that our voices don't matter. They've told us that what we think, what we feel, our concerns are not their concerns. And to add insult to injury, they have believed, or, or they believe that they are smarter than us, and they think that we're too stupid to make our own decisions. Well, let me tell you something. I firmly believe in Article One, Section Two of the Texas Constitution, when it says that all political power is inherent in the people, and it reserves that inalienable right to alter, reform, or abolish our government in such manner as we think expedient to the people. And today, I plunked my, my paperwork on the desk because I believe that it's time for we, the people, to alter the government that we have in Austin. We need a government that represents us, one that doesn't promise that they're going to uh, stop kicking people out of their homes, and a government that will go out and actually abolish the property tax. We're looking for governance in Austin that will 100% without equivocation secure the border by placing the Texas State Guard fully militarized there to stop the invasion. And in the end, across so many other issues, we believe in putting the question of Texas independence back in the hands of the people and let the people decide what the political future of Texas is. So I want to thank you so much, even though you couldn't be here, but for all of these folks that are here today uh, and to you at home that, that are watching this, wherever you are, come join the campaign. Let's take Texas back. Thank you.